I am so proud of you. You are well on your way to becoming an adult member of Ace Hyman. So we've already had Aaliyah where everybody who remembers Sarah from the beginning came up. I was just going to have to tell a hand. So all of you remember her in her stroller when she came in. Many of you held her in services. You know who you are. Even Danielle Kirkman, when he was here once teaching us, comforted her. <coughs> I remember with a smile David did for the sign, no touching by doctor's orders for three months. Sarah spent her very first Shabbat with Ace Hines. No one has a better attendance record than Sarah. This tenacity is seen in all aspects of Sarah's life. She excels at skating, is a wonderful student, and her piano playing is superb. I am honored to be Sarah's mom. Thank you everyone who has helped shape Sarah. This community has played a huge part in our life. Sharon Landau, I'll always remember her, is responsible for getting David and I together. We were married here, Sam grew up here, and was bar mitzvah here. Thank you Mark and David for your continued dedication and work with a time since day one that we've been here. Julie has been fantastic working with Sarah. Thank you for that. Todd has put up with all our crazy requests for this occasion, and Alan stayed calm and cool, despite our efforts to get him crazy. <laughs> Marlene and her staff in the kitchen now are amazing. We're running around. Thank you for that. And Barbara Slutsky has been very patient working with us. So thank you. Retta is the best teacher ever. Keeping Sarah and her classmates in trope learning excited about learning, helping and encouraging Sarah learn her Torah portion and walking us through so much of this. Greta has always been willing to go the extra mile, offering to help before we even knew something had to get done. So thank you, Greta. Sarah has some other wonderful, incredible teachers who have been in her life for many, many years. When Sarah started her second year of skating, we signed her up for a mini lesson session. It turned out she was the only one who signed up, but for some reason, they let her take the lesson, and that's how we met Quentin. Quentin has been Sarah's skating coach since then, and <coughs> while skating is about 80% of what they learn, life lessons are about 20%. So Sarah has, let, has learned from Quentin how to let problems roll off her back. She can hit the ice hard, and even in pain, continue skating. All of this is a tribute to Quentin, and we are very sorry he can't be here, but a family death has prevented that. <laughs> the other teacher shaping Sarah's life is our own Barbara Rubenstein. Thank you, Barbara. Barbara first came into my life decades and decades ago. She taught piano to my brother, Danny, when he was a kid. She, Ted, and my parents were friends before I even knew her. She taught Sam piano since he was four. When I had questions about synagogue that I mentioned in one of his classes, she surprised me by saying she was a member also and made me feel welcome. This is years before I met David here, so maybe she's the reason that we're together. Sarah has been taking piano and musicianship with Barbara since age four. She's been a rock for us through so much. I'm grateful we are friends. As we experienced with Quentin, piano lessons are about 80% of piano and 20% life. Parenting is a community effort, and Sarah is truly a reflection of this community. I wanted to especially thank my Aunt Mickey, as we all heard, coming from L.A. to this horrible weather. We love having you here and appreciate your efforts. Tops, of, tops among appreciated efforts has to be my sister Donna, caterer extraordinaire, and thanks to her husband Hal for always supporting and helping her. I would really appreciate it I know this is hard for everybody to get thank yous, but everybody who begs, if you could stand up. I know there's a lot of you. Thank you all. Thank you all. I do too, so there's lots of food out there, lots of sweets. I'm touched by this outpouring of love and friendship. Thank you, everyone. Make sure you enjoy all of them. There's quite a bit. Grandma gets her due also. Sarah is Bob and Rose's last grandchild to be about mitzvah. For each grandchild's bat mitzvah, Rose has painstakingly needle-pointed each child's talus bag. All four of the 
Talisbeck are here today. So we saw I thought it was we saw them as we saw Sarah's, but I had the other three. So here's all four of them. And we would love it if you would take the opportunity at some point to go and ask. Today, you truly are my favorite, darling, dearest, 